is that your camera? That's cool. Yeah, it's the camcorder. Well, you can start grabbing him if you want. Which cat is that? That's Zeus. He's the complainer. But look at all these. That's, that's a ton of... I know. There's no way. You gotta, we, make, you gotta make like cherry pie or something. Cherry pie? You could sell these at farmer's market for a month or two. Yeah. Look at all of these. There's no way to get them up there. Really, you'd have to have a big ladder. And it's, you know, scaffolding and everything. Look at all these. Yeah. I don't even know where to start. Start with the dark ones. Wow, I wish I could get to that branch. Right up there, it's just huge. Just so many. Just parked in the cul-de-sac. Yeah, you're, you're cool. Oh, wow, there's branches of cherries hitting the house. I wonder if we could go up and go out that window to grab them. This is insane how many there are here. They're just, the branches are hanging down from the weight of the cherries. Yeah, I'll help with that. <laughs> and then it goes all the way down. Yeah, there's not too many down below in the, in the shade. There's a few of them here and there, but the vast majority of them are in the sun, or up higher. Wow. Yeah, there's a bundle. Some of them are ripe and some of them aren't. Wow, just thousands and thousands of cherries and they're growing into this maple. They're pushing the maple over with all the cherries on them. Look at that. This is just insane how many there are. They come way out here. And the maple's blocking the view mostly from this side but you can still see the cherry tree goes way up and above the maple. Look at that. Hey, hello. Today we're gonna to be picking some cherries off our cherry tree here to make some juice. So I just gotta climb up here and get some, uh, get some cherries from way up here. I don't know if you can see me through all the cherries. All right, so we'll just secure the bag here. I already picked a good portion of cherries. Put them inside that bag for secure so they don't fall. Okay, so we just got thousands of them here to pick. A lot of cherries up here. Okay, so we're just picking off some cherries here. We got thousands of cherries on this tree. Most are out of reach. So it's a long task, but we're gonna make some really good organic cherry juice from these. All right, so here we are picking some cherries. We're up pretty high. We're up above the height of the sliding glass door. And that's the third story right there. Look at all these cherries. I don't know if they'll show up being backlit, but the ones that are in the sun are dark red. And then some that are not quite in the sun are still a little pink, like those right there. Those are pink, but we have thousands of dark red ones all over the place all above my head all those branches are filled look at this I'm literally below hundreds and hundreds of cherries 
Look at these dark, dark cherries. Yep. All right, so I got a small bag here. We're gonna be juicing them. There's only a, you know, not even a hundred in there. So, but they're all real yummy. Oh, after a few minutes of picking cherries till I couldn't stand anymore. Standing on a ladder is hard. I'm gonna run the ladder. I got a few cherries. Just a few. Doesn't even look like I've picked any at all. I don't know if I could even wash all of these at once in this little calendar. Let's dump them in and see what happens. Oh, actually I shouldn't. That's gonna bring it up to the top. Let's do this. Let's move some dirty dishes. Put this in here to rinse them. Get some cold water. Oh, I got pieces of the cherry tree in my hair. Let's make sure this thing drains. So we're going to clean off this small amount of cherries I got. And then I'm going to try uh, making some juice. Beautiful. And this is only a few minutes of picking. So my legs can handle standing on the uh, ladder rung eight feet up. That's a bad one there. Wow, I need a bigger colander. Some are red, some are dark, dark red, almost black. But if you juice them, they're fine. But I ate a few, cut a few open to check them, and uh, they were extremely sweet. Best cherry juice I ever had. Can I get them all? Wow. They fit. There's my mound of cherries. Let me dry my hands off before I touch the camera. Yeah. I'm just gonna wash those off and then we'll be juicing it. Very nice cherry. Very sweet. Very good. So here's the apricot tree. And it's got thousands and thousands of apricots. Went all the way over there. Look at all those apricots. Now the bummer is, it's too heavy. So I had to put two by fours. I used a makeshift tree trunk that was cut off to hold up this branch. And I had to put a couple over there to hold up those branches. And now all of these thousands right here, all of those thousands go down to this branch on the left. So if I didn't put that up there, those two by fours, the tree would have split in half. And what I didn't catch was this branch right here. It was straight up high, so I did not see that it was gonna happen. And this happened overnight, possibly with the wind. It broke it. So now we got thousands and thousands still. People have been over here picking these and cleaning these off. So the why you don't see so many here is we've been inviting people over to pick them and clean them. And we picked a bunch off of these branches. I just about tripped on Zeus. And it doesn't even look like we picked any. 
and we've been cleaning these off with the ones that are ripe because these are not totally ripe yet. Some are, some aren't. So you gotta pick and choose them. And then we have peaches as well, but the peaches aren't as plentiful this year. And that one looks like it got a bug on it. Something, got some juice coming out of it. So there's a few little peaches here and there. That's one right there. There's one, three or four there. And then if you look over here, there's a lot of apricots. And then here's the apple tree. That's doing good. So the apples are like bright. They stand right out. You can see them from a distance. And these apples will get a lot bigger. And they will get red. So those are just uh, a few of the apples right there. They'll get a lot bigger than that. And the cherries are all gone. So, and here's the other cherry tree. The other three story tall cherry tree. That goes way up there. And that is it. And there's Phoebe. Phoebe, what are you doing? 